Well, they were a sure sign cold days and chances for snow will soon be a thing of the past. Yes. DC's cherry blossoms. <laughs> the experts at the National Park Service headed for the Tidal Basin today to predict the dates for this year's peak bloom. Okay, so when is it happening and how exactly <laughs> do they figure out those dates? Adam Longo is in the newsroom with the answers. We are just a few weeks away now until the pink starts popping. This was the scene this morning as the National Park Service unveiled its highly coveted peak bloom forecast and it is March 23rd through the 26th. That's when 70% of the trees here encircling the tidal basin are expected to be at peak bloom. Okay, so how does that stack up against some of our previous peak bloom dates? Take a look here. Last year, the forecast called for peak bloom March 21st, 2021 to 28th back in 2020 March 20th. So that was a little bit earlier. And then you have to go back to 2019 and 2018 to find peak blooms in April, April 1st for 2019, April 5th for 2018. Now we've got a chart here that actually goes all the way back to 2004. So it plots the peak bloom forecast for each year. You can see this line. The average date here is April 4th, but as you can see, we've had eight peak blooms over the last 20 years that have been in April, the earliest coming right back here in 2012. Right, so here's some other notable blossom tidbits that we can share with you. The latest peak on record came back in 1958. That was April 18th, and the earliest we've seen peak bloom is March 15th, and that was back in 1990. All right, so we're a little more than three weeks out now. How does the National Park Service arrive at this forecast? We look at the historic record, what happened in, in years past under similar conditions, and we look at the trees. What are the trees telling us? Where are they right now? Where are those so-called indicator trees that maybe give us a glimpse of a couple weeks down the road? All right, so the Park Service will modify this peak bloom forecast if it's going to be warmer or colder than normal over this next month. There is one particular tree, that indicator tree he mentioned, that they keep their eyes on because it generally blossoms two weeks to ten days before all of the other ones here. Adam Longo, WUSA 9.